I like the work that I do to be underpinned by the research that is available in that area. That this is a population of people who have very high mental health care needs and no one is doing anything about it. That if you have a diagnosis of a particular condition, often that diagnosis is used to explain all symptoms that you might show um, to find one person who saw that individual for who they really were, who advocated for them. So there'll be um, stories about people because their physical health is what keeps them alive. These families go through an extraordinary amount of trauma and it becomes their normal and they don't feel that they are allowed to speak it anymore. Because I'm assuming you see the person. Goodness, I hope you see the person. I trust that you see the person. And I teach people practical strategies for uh, managing stress and boosting well-being and also um, reducing anxiety. I think it's a nice thing to reflect upon that when we focus on our differences, that disables everybody. But when we focus on our similarities, that's empowering. I got muddled. Our mental health care needs are surprisingly similar.